Hi, my name is Heather Schmedeke and I'm a photographer based in Berlin. Our lives are so filled with visual information, we're constantly being bombarded with things. It's easy to learn how to shut things down and two things out and only have a selective vision. And that's what traveling and taking photographs does for me, is it helps me keep my eyes open and constantly be aware of situations around me and how I might be able to turn them into a good photograph. Um, whenever I leave my house, I usually have my camera with me because I've been out and about too many times where I wish I would have had my camera and then I've had to go home and get it and come back and hope that the shot is still there. I look for contrasts, contrasts in geometry, contrasts in lighting, contrasts in stillness and motion. I would say what influences my style the most is the narrative. Each photo is an invitation to the viewer to step into the scene and help build the story of that photograph. I like to think about it as walking into a movie or turning on the TV in the middle of a program. There is a certain amount of information there and it's up to you to put the pieces together and create the rest of the story. One thing that I like to do when I'm composing a photograph, especially at night where I have to set up my tripod and use my remote control, is to find a place that I find attractive for the lights, the composition, and the contrast, and then wait for people to move into my frame. Light is really important not only because without it I can't see the image that I want to photograph, but also because of the different types of light, especially with night photography. You have the yellow of sodium lighting, the green of the mercury lights, the blue or white of fluorescent lighting, and then you also have neon lighting, which adds to the mix of colors available to you. favorite times to go out and take pictures is during inclement weather. When it rains, there's so much more that the weather brings to the picture than just making it wet. You have really beautiful reflections that you can capture on the pavement and you also have water drops on your lens if you want them there that can act as a prism and add another element to your photographs.